the Politico piece, which was titled 2022 is the year we all finally got tired of the narcissists, has been branded racist on social media by some fans of Meghan Markle. The article described the 41-year-old as a narcissist along with other featured people, including Donald Trump, Kanye West, and Elizabeth Holmes. In the article, it includes a line that states, some of them got their comeuppance and some of them got worse, our disinterest. Christopher Boozy, who appeared in Meghan and Prince Harry's recent Netflix series, hit back on Twitter, defending Meghan Markle. He wrote that her only offense is having defended herself while being black. He called Meghan's feature the article not an accident and deemed the hatred of Meghan as palpable. Meghan Markle's final act of defiance just as she and Prince Harry exited royal family he also noted, as a woman of color protecting her family and defending herself isn't narcissism, it's survival. In the documentary, he also quoted that the controversy over Meghan and Harry is about hatred, it's about race. One fan of Meghan tweeted that the article's author was jealous of the couple's marriage, calling her out for her very sad, and, desperate behavior. Journalist Victoria Bronworth tweeted about the article, saying, How on earth is Meghan Markle grouped with the likes of criminals, racists and anti-Semites? Meghan Markle and Prince Harry backed into corner by Netflix after money runs dry in defense of the article, Politico's editorial director tweeted, If you want to write off an entire publication because one of our 600 journalists included Meghan Markle on a list, you are indeed tired of free debate. Meghan's feature in the article comes after it was earlier reported, by The Mirror that the Sussex's Netflix series left Prince William utterly furious, due to the couple's further attacks on the royal family, and the institution as a whole. Earlier this month, the couple made headlines for receiving an award for opposing structural racism in the royal family at the Ripple of Hope ceremony in New York. Aside from the Netflix series, which was spread over six episodes released in consecutive weeks, Prince Harry is releasing his 416-page memoir, titled Spare, on January 10, 2023. The memoir, which will be released by Penguin Random House, promises to have been written with raw and unflinching honesty. Ms. Weiss who claimed the show turned her against Meghan and Harry, is yet to publicly respond in regards to her column piece, 